Hey guys, Levi and I here at CES 2011 hanging out at Motorola's booth where we saw one of the more impressive tablets on the show for the Zoom. Give me the details on that. So the Zoom is, Mo is Motorola's big pop here at the show. It's their very first tablet, and it's also the first tablet created specifically for Honeycomb, which is Android's uh, the 3.0 version of Android software, which was designed specifically for tablets. So what is impressive about Honeycomb? What would what would as a consumer, why would I go to that? So the neat thing about Honeycomb is that it doesn't try to recreate a PC experience. It's trying to create an organic experience that makes sense specifically for a tablet. Uh, for example, the interface is entirely in 3D. Um, two good examples of that are, let's take YouTube. Instead of just pasting up the page, YouTube, that you'd see on the web, it recreates you know, your search in a, like a field of television. So it's a nice 3D interface that you can just scroll through, dial down, come back out. It's very slick. Uh, another really neat thing is uh, Google Maps. If you look at Google Map now, for example, on your uh, smartphone, it's a bitmap. It takes a long time to load. Uh, with Honeycomb, it's done all in 3D with vectors so that it's constantly loading really fast because it's only loading those lines. Mm -hmm. Awesome. Anything other, other, any other highlights? Uh, very cool. It has uh, two cameras, uh, one facing you and one facing away. Nice. So that's good for, uh, and the nice thing about the back camera is that it's in HD, so it will take 720 HD video. Very nice. Okay, so price and when will we see it? So Motorola isn't talking price here. Uh, neither for uh, the tablet itself or the eventual 4G upgrade, uh, but it will be out in the first quarter of this year and it is exclusive uh, initially to Verizon. Very, very cool. Thank you very much. Guys, if you want any more information on Zoom or CES 2011 in general, keep it tuned to IGN.com.